Thanks for getting adult. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think I hear the roof leaking tonight. <laughs> Dad, it's 10 p.m. There's no time like the present. <laughs> Dad, mm -hmm. I have questions. Sure. Okay, um, two people love each other. Actually, love doesn't even have to be part of it. Uh, <laughs> blah, blah, blah. Naked hugging, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> okay, what about protection? It's a conceal and carry state. Sexual protection? Oh, well, hello there, Miss Leyland Jenner. What are you doing home so <laughs> <laughs> Me and Sarah were hanging out, and we're thinking about having sex, Mom. Okay, I know there's a lot of things that can go wrong, and I just want to be safe about it. <laughs> well, it sounds. Got it all figured out. Good night. See you in the morning. <laughs> Guys, why is this so hard for you to talk about? This is important. Hey, it's it's not that we don't think it's important. It's just it's it's awkward. It's, it's an awkward conversation. It's uncomfortable. Like when your dentist mentions fortune. <laughs> <laughs> what better time to talk about it? Right here. Right now. At 8 p.m. <laughs> At the Annoying Theater Bar. Seriously? <laughs> Question one. Do you come here often? Uh, 
the uh, woods? No, I'm doing the Reese Witherspoon wild thing to get in shape with the Julie Roberts eat pray love things. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you can stand tight up a little bit. Excuse me? Question <laughs> <laughs> 15. <laughs> you want to do a shot? <laughs> yeah, your rumblements, the slippery nipple. <laughs> Would you hold it against me? Oh, yeah. Would well, you have to answer if you want to get by? No, I would not hold my body against yours, okay? Can I go? Alright, alright. Not so fast here, sister ass. <laughs> now you have to ask the bridge troll and questions at the read. <laughs> Three questions and I, I can go.
from the planet Uranus. We are going to liquefy your planet and read the brain juice. And while you endure infinite suffering and pain while slowly melting, you will be listening to the Serpent People's favorite band, Pittsburgh Steel. Your parents fall 
follow through on their, their threat to burn everything in your room if you didn't clean it. <laughs> 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 they say pull from your real life. <laughs> I had one of them Huey Herman pole pin things and it spoke to me. It said like, uh -huh. <laughs> Then I found it in the, in the burn pile. <laughs> <laughs> going through my little brain right now. <laughs> it's called emotion. <laughs> I don't know why that worked, Bars. I don't want to know why. Sometimes you just add numbers together till you get the right ones. Best friends forever. <laughs> you got the job, Lars. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
Because I was a Muslim in the country as a child. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I have some bad news. Uh, Ty, the, the gentleman with the glasses and the black button up shirt, has stolen something. Uh, unfortunately, he doesn't remember. What he stole, who his accomplice was, or where he has stashed it, as he has early onset CTE. Actually, the real thief here is the NFL. So, uh, we, we're going to help him try to remember by interrogating him and to get the information out of him. So, what we need from you, lovely people, are three things his accomplice, the thing he stole, and where he has stashed it. So, for his accomplice, we need a celebrity, someone in the news, anybody, a suggestion, any celebrity at all. Dame uh, Judy Dench. Joe Biden. <laughs> so, Ty's accomplice was Joe Biden. Now he stole something. Let's, let's give it a price tag of above $80. Something you might buy at Target for more than $80. A lawnmower. A lawnmower. Thank you. Joe Biden, lawnmower. He is stashed it somewhere, somewhere that fits on this stage. Suggestions, a location that might fit on his stage. His kitchen dad's cabinet. Dead. His dad's den. <laughs> and you know he his dad. <laughs> so anyways, Ty and Joe Biden stole a lawnmower and stashed it in Ty's dad's den, which <laughs> totally happened. <Yeah. laughs> I'll bring it in, <laughs> <laughs> so, we know that you stole something with someone and hid it somewhere. <laughs> what about? Oh, just one of your many vices. Huh. Is that a fact? So, who'd you steal it with? Like an accomplice? Yeah! <laughs> Yeah, a lot of good-looking people for their age. <laughs> Too specific. 
specific for this. <laughs> And in straight lines. <laughs> and you're skipping the corners. I like to mow the lawn just like Yay! everybody else. Yay! Put the lawn mower. Put the lawn mower. Right. Is that a crime? It is. <laughs> <laughs> you're such a sick fuck, you stashed it in a very personal, <laughs> private place. <laughs> So I won't need my passport to get there. Exactly, because I assume it's in the U.S. <laughs> <laughs> so you're talking about Florida. <laughs> you would trash on Florida. That's just a fact. Low hanging fruit's the one they use for the orange juice. Uh, it's not a state, but when you, you're there, you achieve a state of mind. <laughs> to be super honest, I don't exactly know what this room is for. <laughs> so me and Joe Biden took a lawnmower and went to the parlor. The parlor of the house. Oh, you are. You are nearby. <laughs>